The voices came from all directions. It's like, what do I do? Everyone, it seemed, wanted the best for Aaron Hernandez. Half the family told me to go here. Half my family told me to go to Notre Dame, Michigan, Miami. And I just, my head is just going crazy. For a kid barely old enough to drive, it came down to one opinion, his. UConn was his first choice before reversing field and settling on Florida. He thinks he's 100% sure. Uh, maybe 99.9, .9, but... <laughs> okay. But there's still a crack in the door. <laughs> there's a crack. Okay, okay. Connecticut still wants Hernandez, especially one Husky. His brother DJ, UConn's starting quarterback. At first, like, he wouldn't even talk to me. But there's days he's saying, like, it's our dream to play together. Come on, please. Without his brother, Aaron says he wouldn't be in this position. He was a self-described lazy big body until his older brother got a hold of him. Yeah, he's very hard. I mean, we work all summer. If I drop a ball, it's 100 push-ups. And he throw, he, sometimes he stands 10 yards away and just checks his hardest at me. And I got to catch it. It used to hit me in the face, but now I'm pretty good at catching it. <laughs> so good, he's the number one rated high school tight end in the country. His newfound success came at a loss, though, the death of his father earlier this year. I was the number one tight end in the country, and then he passed away, and I started to work harder and harder for him, and it happened. I talk to him. I hear him sometimes. And his dad's words ring loud and clear. Good job. You stink. <laughs> what are you doing? Start blocking. Um, good catch. Every once in a while, he says something funny. In Bristol, I'm John Pearson, News Channel 8.